Hi guys, so I have been successfully able to go at 250 millimeters per second for infill um, with TPU material, uh, flexible material. This is 95A hardiness. Um, I got this really, really nice uh, ball bearing spool holder that I've been uploading the last few days. It works really, really well because every time the printer needs a little bit more filament, it is so smooth. There's four ball bearings. I just pull it out and keeps the filament loose. And I believe after this change, I was able to go fast and get excellent quality. I'm going as fast as I can uh, on these uh, Prusa MK3S Plus uh, with no other modif modifications. So all you really uh, need to do is actually, I did loosen the screw. Make sure you loosen this uh, the idler screw. I screw it all the way, uh, have it slightly come out a little bit like that. It's just barely in there. And then um, also I find using uh, Octoprint uh, helpful because I have this other printer that doesn't have Octoprint, just printing off SD card. And I was trying to print the same thing and I would ha keep having trouble. So I guess Octoprint actually does help um, print a lot better because it's, obviously it's just sending G code. Um, so I think Octoprint does improve, uh, especially when you're dealing with TPU. Uh, but look at that flawless prints. Look how, look how the, the filament stays super loose. You can even see. All right, and then, and then the beauty of the ball bearing. Um, again, I'll have an update on this with all the files that I use. I had to modify a bunch of it to make it work just right for me. Um, some of the percentages were wrong, but once you get it working right, I mean, it's an awesome, it's an awesome setup. You don't need um, something else to go faster on the proof, so you just need to get a ball bearing spool holder. Anyway, have a great day.